It's the Western Conference Finals, Game 3. The Dallas Mavericks come into Game 3 up two games to none. Will their relentless desire thrust them to a third straight victory? The scenery changes to hostile ground as they face off against the Timberwolves. The quest for the best in the West continues, coming up next. And already a 2-0 lead established in this series. It's the Western Conference Finals on 2K Sports. Alongside Hall of Famers Doris Burke and Grant Hill, I'm Brian Anderson, Ali LaForce on the sidelines. So the opening lineup for the Timberwolves, Edwards at the 2 with McDaniels at the 3. Inside, we got Towns and Gobert, and it's Conley in at the point guard position. And for Dallas, Luka and Kyrie are the talented backcourt. Daniel Gafford is out there with Washington, and it's Exum in at the 3, the small forward. You look at Dallas, and they have themselves in great position after winning the first two on the road. Yeah, I mean, they snatched home court advantage in game one, took game two, and now they've got a huge leg up. A win here tonight in this series is all but over. Go. Tip off goes to Minnesota. Conley against Doncic. A shot by Conley. No good. And Dallas with possession. Doncic on the wing. He's guarded by Conley. Over to the left wing. Gafford with a screen on Edwards. Shot clock at six. Exum passes to Doncic. 4-3. Edwards pulls it in. Yeah, I know. He usually makes you pay from that range. Outside Conley. To Edwards. Picked by Gobert. Fires from deep. And it's Anthony Edwards with the three. Uh, the work that Anthony Edwards is putting in as a shooter is there. That range shot so important. Nice three-point look right there. Outside Irving. And stolen by Edwards. To the paint. Here's Conley. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. There is an imagination of creativity. This guy's passing drives the offense. Played here in the first. Pass to Gafford. Edwards against Irving. Gafford with a screen on Edwards. Irving, the pass to Gafford. Basket is good. Nice setup from Irving. That nice touch pass right there by Kyrie Irving. That was pretty. For Minnesota, they've gone two of three from the floor. Looking for an opening. And the call is going to be, yes, on a legal screen. You can get away with one once in a while. But it looked like he wasn't completely set on that pick. I don't think there's any question. There are so many rules that favor the offense these days. You've got to be able to equal things out when an illegal screen is set. Now here's Doncic. Gafford in the post. He's against Gobert. From deep, here's Doncic. Drains the triple. Well, Luka Doncic on the receiving end of a quality pass. We usually see him with the ball. Conley against Doncic. Conley passes to Edwards. No good on the triple. Dallas has gone one or two from three-point land so far. Pass to Gafford. Back to Irving. Banked it in off the glass. Gets in the paint and drains it. Kyrie Irving, show off that touch. Takes a step back. Low block shot. And Edwards with a nice bucket inside. 
Edwards got five points. Now you want to get him going as soon as possible. Great way for him to start this game. He's a guy who, if he gets hot, he can carry your offense for long stretches. Man, good whistle there. Now at the line for your batters, Luca Dodge. Two shots. Shoot two. First free throw is good. Boy, Luca's strength, his size, his savvy puts him at the free throw line so often. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Here's Edwards. He's got five. About three minutes gone here in the first quarter. And Edwards slams it in. Oh, Anthony Edwards thinks this game is a dunk contest. Go ahead, young sir. What a finish. On the AT&T 5G slam cam, good looks by our terrific camera crew. The Mavericks trailing. Here's Doncic. He's got five. Oh, it's stolen by Towns. Edwards against Irving. And Edwards the bucket on the assist by Conley. He's got nine. Off to a fantastic start. He's four for five. Watch out. Pass to Washington. Doncic outside. From outside the arc. Nice. Gets his second bucket. He's two for four now. Luca from way downtown. Conley against Doncic. Conley passes to Gobert. Back to Conley. And he drives in. Outside McDaniels. Just three to shoot. The Mavericks pull it in. Defensive positioning is so important, and he could not have played him better there. From deep, here's Doncic. Towns with a rebound. The Timberwolves have gone 5 of 8. Solid opening quarter for them. Edwards for 3. Hey, in 6 attempts, he's made 5. Talk about efficiency. And he's carried them this quarter. A dominant offensive stretch. Outside Irving. Irving's got his second bucket of the night. But Kyrie may be the best finishing guard in the history of the game. His ability to contort his body or spin the basketball, ridiculous. Now here's Edwards. 12 points for him. Kicks it out, Towns. The three is up. And the Timberwolves hit again from deep. The defense must chase Carl Anthony Towns off that three-point line. This guy is timeout, such timeout. a great jump shooter. Timeout on the floor. Mavericks. Doncic. Give him eight points now. Irving, the pass to Washington. Now here's Doncic. Irving with it. Just five on the clock. Ha! Well-timed shot fake. Got the defender off the ground right there. Well, you know that Kyrie is going to be looking for a shot in that situation. It isn't hard for him to find one ever, it seems. Now here's Towns. Three-pointer off the mark. Given his
his range, you'd expect him to capitalize on that open. Doncic passes to Irving. Doncic outside. Gafford the screen. The three ball. Doncic, no good. Right now trying to get into a rhythm, but so far this quarter, boy, he is struggling to make anything go down. The Mavericks have got six of ten attempts to fall. And he got the whistle on the way up, so he'll be headed to the line for a pair. We are talking about a clever scorer. Luka Doncic has developed such a knack for getting to the free throw line. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from here for the Timberwolves. Yeah, their early focus on outside scoring has paid off. They're finding plenty of points from three-point land. And they've also shown dominance in the paint so far tonight, really putting the work in down low. No good on the free throw. Morris, he's checked in for Conlon. Second free throw is good. Here's Morris. Outside Edwards. Pass to Gobert. Outside McDaniels. Back to Gobert. The kick out to Edwards. Over Irving. Morris right side. Towns outside. Edwards finds Towns. To the inside. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. What a setup by Carl Anthony Towns. Knew his team had to capitalize on that opening. Doncic passes to Irving. Back to Doncic. Basket is good. Nice setup from Irving. Irving's got three assists in the game. <laughs> this night already has the makings of an offensive war. Well, the fans love it. Coaches may not like the lack of defense, but boy, the rules promote scoring, no doubt. Now here's Morris, still without a bucket. It's Edwards on the wing. He drains it as the shot clock ticks down. And the Timberwolves lead by three. This guy has been a catalyst for them all game long. What a job leading them to this lead. Pass to Doncic. Launches it. Towns with a rebound. Minnesota has gone three of six shooting from beyond the arc. McDaniels a screen on Doncic. Towns for three. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. And he probably thought he was going to bury that one. The three from Washington. That won't go. Misses his first shot of the game. McDaniels passes to Morris. Towns outside. Nice. Gets his second bucket. He's two for four now. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. Morris against Doncic. Laid it in with a nice touch off the window. Doncic has got 13. Well, individually, he is doing everything he can in this 12-minute session, but he's just not getting enough help. Edwards against Irving. Outside Edwards. And Edwards slams it in. Anthony Edwards has got his rhythm, and he's got a well-rounded offensive game. Look out. Doncic passes to Irving. Morris against Doncic. Uses the glass on the layup. 15 points in the game. I'll tell you, despite this guy's strong play in this period, they're still behind. Someone else has got to step up. And Minnesota calls time here.
changes here for the Timberwolves. Reed's checked in for Gobert. Anderson comes in for McDaniels. And it's Alexander Walker in for Edwards. Alexander Walker, the pass to Morris. Outside, Anderson. Clock at six. That shot, no good. Good D by Hardaway. The Mavericks trailing. On the wing, Green. Three-pointer. Gets the three to fall. Well, you want some unselfishness from a guy who's capable of scoring. And Tim Hardaway says, you know what? My teammate's open. I'm going to get him the ball. Now here's Morris. He's scoreless. Here's Towns. Counted. And it's Morris with the assist. Boy, it seems like every shot he puts up, it's going in. This guy is hot. Hot. Now here's Hardaway. He's closely guarded. Fires for three. Here's Lively. And he dunks it down. That'll drive your coach crazy, failing to box out. And to me, this is a common theme that's running through the league right now. Guys looking to leak out rather than box out. Towns outside. Morris passes to Towns. Anderson against Green. Rebounded by Green. And it's Green with the ball for Dallas. First personal foul. Third team foul. Now at the line for your Mavericks. Shot. Green. Two shots. off. Jones, he's checked in for the Mavericks. And the Timberwolves also making a change. Edwards, he's checked in for Towns. And now they lead as the free throw drops in for him. Minnesota has gone three of seven from beyond the arc in the first. Morris outside. Pass to Reed. From seven feet away. Off target with a jump hook. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. Doncic passes to Lively. Outside Jones. Doncic outside. Let's go with a three. Gets the three ball to go. Doncic has got 18. The defense has to know they're going to get a steady diet of three-point shooting from Luka. You must contest. Three-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. There's the drive, and there it is for him. And now it's a six-point Dallas lead. Luka, one of the most prolific drivers in the game, and boy, does he make a pretty move there. And Edwards puts up a deep three. Oh, and the release was before the buzzer, but it's off target. Well, offense is the order of the day as the first quarter comes to a close. Mavericks ahead, leading by six. Don't go anywhere, folks. We'll be back in a moment.
have you with us as we return to the action here in the Western Conference Finals. All right, guys, what do you think so far on the offensive approach for Dallas? Well, they found a groove, and it's from distance, so knocking them down from the three-point land never hurts. Yeah, they've also been alert and active on the defensive end, creating turnovers and turning those into points on the offensive end. The Mavericks leading. Josh Green out there with Derek Jones. Then it's Kyrie Irving. Then it's Tim Hardaway. And it's Lively in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. So that's who Dallas starts the second with. Three on three. Here's Edwards. Drops it in from 14 feet away. He's got 18. Anthony Edwards just reading what the defense giving up. Gets to his mid-range game right there. Morris against Irving. Over Morris. And the shot's good by Irving. And the Mavericks lead by six. This guy is a pick-your-poison kind of player. Very hard defensively to cover all your bases with him. Morris passes to Edwards. Driving inside. It's good. Edwards has got 20. Well, Anthony Edwards says, yes, you're playing exceptional defense, but my offensive game is better. I'm a solid 225. Now, here's Hardaway. No points yet. Irving for three. He missed there. His first misfire in five tries. Morris deciding where to go with it. To the middle. The kick out to Edwards. They set the screen. Beyond the arc. Oh, he nails it. Ten for 14 after that one. And he's coming off a huge performance, and his confidence couldn't be any higher. And his coach knows that, too. Well, the best players, to me, deliver night after night after night. So as long as he's hot, keep riding it. Sends it home from three-point land. Now, there is a special nature to Kyrie Irving's ability to answer back with the three. Pass to Alexander Walker. Edwards against Hardaway. Shot is good by Edwards. Edwards got nine points now in the quarter. By every time he goes up now, it just looks like the shot's going in. He's perfect from the field in this quarter. Goes up at the strike. Again, Dallas. And a little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the second quarter. Timeout call, Timeout. the Timberwolves. play almost three minutes gone here Anderson against Green pass to Lively six on the shot clock outside Jones for three on target from range and now it's a seven point Dallas lead well the defense daring him to shoot and he makes them pay for their disrespect Alexander Walker pass to Anderson now here's Reed, defended by Jones. Here's Alexander Walker. And they waste no time getting those three points back. This quarter, they're doing some real damage from outside the arc. Trying to stay within striking distance here. Outside Irving. From the arc. And yes, it's good. He's seven for eight now. They're shooting nearly 50% from beyond the arc, and their confidence is growing. Irving against Morris. Outside Edwards. 
The three is up. And that comes off the assist by Morris. Morris has got three assists tonight. They're going to have to pay more attention to him on the perimeter. He's hit four three-pointers already today. Now here's Green. Pass to Irving. Rebound, Minnesota. Anderson against Jones. Left side, Anderson. And he can't get that one. And the Mavericks making a change here. Washington's checked in. Gobert's checked in for the Timberwolves. Conley comes in for Morris. Dallas has gone three of four from outside so far in the second quarter. Outside Hardaway. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. It's going to be on Nas Reed. Well, this is a quick and decisive offensive player who's not afraid of contact. Love Tim Hardaway Jr. accepting the contact. Two shots. Shooting two. And he knocks down the first one. I'll tell you, Tim Hardaway Jr. has shown signs of being a lights-out scorer. And he's got the game to do just that. He looks better and better every year, guys. Hardaway hits them both. Productive trip to the line. He doesn't like to leave points on the table. And so it's Conley who brings up the ball for the T-Wolves. They trail by six. Outside Edwards. Puts up a three. Hits a three-pointer. Edwards has got 31 points. Oh, five threes this half. The D can't contain this guy. Here's Irving. That one falls. Eight of ten and scoring with confidence. Well, they're calling his number time and time again, and he is delivering. Pass to Reed. Here's Alexander Walker. Green covering. Here's Alexander Walker. He's in his comfort zone. Two for two to start this one. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Conley against Irving. And there's the foul. It'll go on Kyrie Irving. That's his first foul. And this kind of selflessness is great to see. Textbook positioning to draw the charge. Gafford, he's checked in for the Mavericks. Exum comes in for Green. Carl Anthony Towns has checked in for the Timberwolves. McDaniels comes in for Alexander Walker. And here's Conley. Here's the pick. And here's Edwards outside. Gafford grabs the miss. Gafford's got four rebounds now. Irving against Conley. Gafford with a screen on Conley. And Gobert with a block. There is a reason his nickname is the Stifle Tower. Send it back, Rudy. Washington's shot is good. They're unafraid to let it rip from downtown, extending their lead. Now Conley. Outside Edwards. And Edwards slams it in. And that strength and concentration from Anthony Edwards. Yes, there's contact. Doesn't bother him. And Dallas calls time here. Irving. 
Here's Doncic. Give him 20. Hardaway finds Doncic. Fires the three. Doncic delivers from range. And this is how he shines. He's a big part of their floor space. And right now, Greg, he is doing a great job delivering for this team. Productive and efficient. Downs passes to McDaniels. Down low. Six to shoot. The kick out to Edwards. Up and over Hardaway. And Minnesota again with a bucket. He's shooting the lights out down the stretch, trying to keep them competitive. Here's Doncic. Oh, Luka, like a bull in there. Yeah, Luka decides when he wants to get into the rise of fire. That pull-up game off point. Edwards against Hardaway. Here's the three. Edwards can't hit. I'll tell you what. They've been aggressive, and they've been physical. Now, here's Hardaway. Pass to Exum. Washington, a screen on McDaniels. Exum passes to Washington. And he can't extend the lead to double digits. He is too good a shooter, guys, to be left open like that. The defense just dodged a bullet there. To the left wing. Back to Edwards. Towns for three. Hardaway grabs the board. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's the shot he typically makes. Pass to Doncic. Inside. And the dunk by Gafford. Well, the playmaking skills of Luka Doncic are truly extraordinary. So young, so good. And so it's Edwards who brings up the ball for Minnesota. Nine-point game. That one off the back iron and out. Dallas shooting 64% for the game. Amazing. against Doncic from downtown Minnesota with a rebound Conley with the ball outside McDaniels pass to Gobert from deep Conley fires in the triple Conley's gotten a second bucket on the night how about Gobert with the find on time and on target nicely done Rudy Here's Doncic outside. The rebound by the Timberwolves. Towns has got four rebounds now. McDaniels finds Conley. Outside Edwards. There's the triple. Washington grabs the miss. The Mavericks leading. Pass to Exum. Now here's Gafford. Doncic with it. Covered by Towns. Fades back. And there's Doncic. That's good. On the assist by Gafford. Doncic has got 27. Boy, yet another night for Luka Doncic. This guy is forcing everyone to play at his pace right now. Towns against Washington. Here's McDaniels. Gafford grabs the miss. Gafford's got six rebounds now in the game. Doncic on the wing. This one for three. Knocks down the triple. And now it's an 11-point Dallas lead. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. One thing we've learned in the NBA, the game is never over. So you've got to continue to score, continue to build your lead. Now here's Conley. He's got six. And count it. The shot is good, and he'll go to the line. A steady start has turned into a spectacular second quarter for him. Kyrie Irving's checked in for the Mavericks. I think Anthony Edwards 
Anderson has got all the makings of not only a star in this league, but a superstar. Big frame, can score it, can board it, can handle it. Put him in any position on the floor, this guy can be successful. Size, explosion, he's a dangerous finisher. And we saw it right there. Outside Edwards, fires the three. That one's good. And it's Conley who picks up the assist. Conley's got his fifth assist in this one. Dallas shooting has been tremendous. 63% for the game and scoring with confidence. Doncic passes to Irving. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Now, Irving isn't just a perimeter player. He's so dynamic inside as a scorer. His strength is savvy, tough to keep the defense on balance. No good on that one. One thing that stands out about Kyrie Irving, obviously, his creativity, especially when it comes to his handle, as good as it gets. The Timberwolves making a switch here. Alexander Walker's checked in. And he sinks the second. Here's Conley. He has six. Pass to Alexander Walker. Doncic against Conley. Takes it inside. Chalk up two there. Conley's got his third bucket of the night. Well, there's not a little bit of hesitation with Mike Conley. I know he's slight of frame, but he's thinking, I can score it on the painted area. Doncic against Conley. Launches it from deep. Oh! Dodging from way out there. Oh, what a performance by Luka Doncic. He has been the story for the Dallas Mavericks. His fingerprints were all over that quarter. 13 <laughs> points, leading the charge. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. I'm here with P.J. Washington. P.J. will be the key for you guys defensively in the second half. Uh, not letting them get easy routes to the basket and uh, contesting their shots, rebounding, and uh, not letting them get second chance points. Comes back to the fundamentals, guys. Okay, Ali, appreciate it. And folks, we'll be back after halftime to begin the third quarter. Howdy folks, game three here at the half and it is a substantial deficit for the Minnesota Timberwolves. Well, they aren't getting a hand up on the shooters and the numbers show it, Shaq. Guys are too good in this league to give them easy looks. You're just digging your own grave. Well, excuse me, Jack, giving the tough love. Bravo, bravo. Looking at the series breakdown for the Mavericks. A dream start, two wins on the road, and now a chance to go up three zip at home. Well, they're definitely sitting in a good place, but they gotta watch their backs. Yeah, overconfidence could be their downfall. They can't get complacent and miss a chance to widen their lead. Uh, yeah, I like their chances. That's it for us. Thanks for tuning in. Now let's send you over to Brian Anderson with the third period. Welcome back to our coverage of Game 3 on 2K Sports. And you know, Anthony Edwards has been really making it happen, guys. Yeah, tonight he's done a great job of slashing through the lane and finishing. And part of that has to do with his mindset. He has been looking to push the action at every opportunity, and he has been in attack mode all night. Kicking off the second half, here's Chris Finch's five. McDaniels and Towns in at the forward slot. Conley at the guard with Edwards next to him. And it's Gobert in at the center position. Conley is screen on Irving. Towns right side. 
over Washington. That's good from Towns on the assist from Edwards. Towns has got nine. Well, this is what makes Towns so dangerous. Pick and roll, pick and pop. He can take you either way off that screen. Pass to Doncic. Washington, a screen on Conley. Back to Washington. Let's the three fly. Another three for Dallas. This defense is getting spaced out. Three of the last five buckets have come from way beyond the arc. Towns outside. Now Edwards. Over Irving. Edwards can't hit. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. Towns finds Conley. You can see that defenders try to play with a level of physicality against Mike Conley, but this guy's such a tough competitor, he'll get to the line. Free throw drops for Conley. I think Mike Conley historically will always be part of the grit and grind mentality where he spent his career in Memphis. But this guy's skill set allows him to fit in with any organization. And so he hits both. Maverick shooting with some fire. 66% of this one. Pass to Gafford. And here's Doncic. And he lobs it up to the rim. And the dunk by Gafford. Boy, the extraordinary playmaking instincts of Luka Doncic on display right there. Edwards, a pass to McDaniels. Here's Towns. He's guarded by Washington. Double team on Towns. Back to Daniels. Five on the clock. And the jumper is good. Boy, when Towns is moving the basketball, guys, the floor opens up for him. The defense has now got to respect passing and scoring. Now here's Doncic. 33 points for him. Yeah, you never want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. First team. And he makes a first. Doncic hits them both. For Minnesota, they've got two of three from the floor in this third quarter. Outside Edwards. Edwards is doubled. Out left to the wing. Towns for three. And his fifth basket. Now five for eight. Looking comfortable out there. A fantastic three-point shooter. you got to guard Towns from the corners especially. Doncic passes to Irving. On the take. That one falls. Great setup by Doncic. Doncic has got his sixth assist of the night. Brilliant second half start. Four for four from the field. Can't ask for any better. Now here's Edwards. And he's got 41 now. The kick out to Conley. Let's it go from deep. The Mavericks pull it in. And right now they're plus eight in the rebounding category. That's helping them run away with this. Here's Doncic, and the Mavericks getting another bucket right there. And right now, that's five buckets in a row. Looking like a well-oiled machine coming out of the break. 
Conley against Doncic. Edwards for three. Washington grabs the miss. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Stolen by Conley. Second half here, and we're just over three and a half minutes into it. Towns taking his time here. Conley against Irving. The Timberwolves need to get off a shot here. Another miss by Minnesota. Well, he's a quality mid-range shooter, but he can't get that one to go. Doncic passes to Irving. Washington, a screen on Edwards. To the inside. Ooh, Gobert with a steal. Outside Edwards. Pass to Towns. Back to Edwards. Conley against Doncic. It's McDaniels on the wing. Four on the clock. Over Gafford. McDaniels, that's good. McDaniels got four points this quarter. There he is, showing off his low post skills. Go to work, young man. Doncic passes to Washington. From deep. Edwards pulls it in. We all know he's a good shooter, but from that distance, uh, I don't think so. Boy, we're seeing it more and more. Guys looking to create additional space by stepping back further from the line. Now here's McDaniels. Six points for him from deep Conley. Gafford grabs the miss. Gafford's got his eighth rebound here tonight. And their physical dominance has been on display. A 10 rebound advantage is a good indicator of how this game has gone. Conley against Doncic. Offline with a three. The Timberwolves have gone four of nine in the third quarter. Conley up top. Ten points for him. Towns outside. Pass to McDaniels. From behind the arc. That's in. Coming off an assist from Towns. Three. Towns has got his third assist of the night. Here is Irving. He's got 21. Doncic, right side. The rebound by the Timberwolves. Gobert's got five rebounds in the game. Conley against Doncic. Gobert goes up and brings it down. Well, spectacular athleticism from the seven-foot center Gobert. Wow. Here's Doncic. Oh, no good. The dry spell continues. Pass to McDaniels. Here's Gobert. And here's Edwards outside. Washington grabs the miss. Dallas is gone. Only one of three from deep here in the third. Now Irving. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. Now here's McDaniels. He's covered closely. Conley against Doncic. Kicks it out Towns. Outside McDaniels. And it's good with time running down on the shot clock. And now just a four-point Dallas lead. Now a timeout called by Dallas. And the Mavericks with some changes. Jones comes in for Washington. And Hardaway is subbed in for Kyrie Irving. And the Timberwolves also making a change. Alexander Walker's checked in. have gotten five of ten shots to go. Doncic against Conley. 
to end the cold spell. And Doncic with the three. Doncic has got 40 points. Deep into the game, you rely on players like him to keep delivering. Out of bounds, it'll go to the Mavericks. Doncic throwing his weight around. This guy has been unstoppable. It has not mattered at all what the defense throws at him. He's had an answer. Outside Edwards. The three. And again for three. And he's letting it fly from long range to devastating effect. And has now tied the franchise record for triples in a playoff game. Gafford with a screen on Conley. Tries the spin move. Here's Doncic. Doncic! You see the strength. Wow, you see the physical defense against Luka. Didn't even matter. He powers right through it. Conley against Doncic. Towns the screen on Doncic. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. That one on Doncic. <laughs> A moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Mavericks. Their hot shooting from long distance has been the key. Spacing the floor and rising up with that confidence. I think another thing that's striking here tonight, the ball movement is incredible. Again and again, they're making smart passes to ready shooters. The first one falls. Reeds checked in for the Timberwolves. Anderson comes in for Anthony Edwards. And Conley drops them both. For Dallas, they've gone 8 of 13 in the second half. Doncic deciding where to go with it. To the right side. Lots of room. And the Mavericks getting another bucket right there. Really good anticipation by Dante Exum. He feels the defense laying off and he sticks it. Doncic against Conley. There's a screen from deep. Knocks down the long J. Conley's got 15 points. Well, you've got to be able to contest. This is a career 37% three-point shooter. You better get out there on Mike Conley. Doncic outside. Goes up on the wing. Towns with a rebound. Towns has got six rebounds now in the game. Outside, Anderson. Pass to Towns. Reed against Jones. Reed, good. Their spacing isn't quite as good as it was in the first half. They may need to hit more threes to stretch that defense. Outside Hardaway, here's Doncic. They set a pick. Takes a three. Here's Lively. That one falls. Great setup by Doncic. Yeah, showing a little versatility with their offensive attack. In the first half, it was about the three ball. In the second half, they've emphasized interior scoring. Now here's Conley. 15 points in the game. Pass to Towns. Here's Alexander Walker. No good with the triple. Well, he won't miss many from that spot. The defense gets lucky there. Doncic against Conley. Doncic passes to Exum. And the Mavericks, another three! Well, Dante Exum knocking down shots will put a smile on this team's face. It continues to work on the offensive end. Pass to Towns. And out of bounds. Dallas will have it. And the Mavericks making a change here. Green is checked in. Morris, he's checked in for the Timberwolves. Here's Doncic. He'll bring it up for Dallas. 
And Luka Doncic is going to pick up the foul. That's his fourth foul of the contest. And with plenty of time left, that's his fourth foul. He needs to stay cognizant of that moving forward. The Timberwolves trail. Morris outside. Morris, a screen on Hardaway. Here's Alexander Walker. Ooh, once again, off the mark by Minnesota. And they just continue to dominate the boards. Outside Hardaway. Doncic left side. And Doncic the bucket on the assist from Hardaway. Hardaway's got four assists now tonight. the line for your backers. Shot three. One shot. Free throw no good for Green. Minnesota's gone four of nine from beyond the arc since the break. Here's Alexander Walker. The kick out to Morris to end the run. He buries it from three. Morris has gotten himself going here. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Doncic against Morris. Doncic outside. Doncic on the take. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Doncic has got 15 points here in the second half. Let's remember, Luke is 6'7", 230, so this guy lethal around the hoop. And that does it for the third quarter. As we approach the fourth, the Mavericks on top, up by nine. And we're coming right back. Be sure to stay with us as we get set for quarter number four. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. You can count on him to deliver a few assists like this one each and every night. You know a thing or two about a point guard's job. Set the table for your teammates. Done there perfectly. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. They've got Tim Hardaway. Washington out there with Josh Green. Then it's Kyrie Irving, and it's Lively in at the five spot. That's the lineup in the game for Dallas. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Irving fires from way outside. Rebound Minnesota. Outside Anderson. Reed sets a screen. Edwards for three. Connects again from distance. And talk about stepping up. He's having a playoff game these fans have never seen. And that last triple means he's got the most threes in a single playoff game in franchise history. That is Kyrie Irving in a nutshell. You want to give him the mid-range, he'll take it. Thompson, a three-level score. Pass to Edwards. The three. He got it again. <laughs> Sensational. Talk about coming up huge. What a performance. He's nearing the franchise record for most points in a playoff game. Man, this guy is clutch. Kyrie Irving is lighting it up right now, just letting everybody see every aspect of skill to his game. Now Reed. Pass to Anderson. Morris outside. Six on the shot clock. Reed with it. And it's blocked. And he's able to get it back. For Dallas, they've gone two of three to open the fourth quarter. Outside Irving. Outside Hardaway. Shoots over Anderson. Hardaway, no good. 
Minnesota has gone two of three from beyond the arc here in the fourth. Anderson can't get it to go. And for him, that's a great look. Expect him to go right back to it if it's available. Well, no doubt. Very good play call, good execution. Sometimes it just doesn't fall. Since hitting two triples in the first half, he's been non-existent from out there. And it's Irving with a rebound. And so it's Irving with it. He brings it up for Dallas. And Washington powers it through. I'll tell you, that vertical ability he has puts him in select company in NBA power forwards. May not have great size, but boy, he plays bigger than him. Now here's Reed. And there's the whistle. The illegal screen is the call. Up until that play, his ball handling had been impeccable. He's given it up just one time. Some changes for Minnesota. Warren comes in for Anderson. And Mike Conley is subbed in for Morris. Now here's Irving. Pass to Lively. Outside for Green. On the wing, Irving. Over Edwards. And Irving, the bucket on the assist by Green. Irving's got six in the quarter. That is pure from Kyrie. Fantastic working off the catch. And the Timberwolves call time here. Checked in for Hardaway. The Timberwolves also with a sub. Garza's checked in for Warren. A moment to hear from Ali LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Chris Finch was going over with his team. And he was adamant that they need to tighten up their D. That lack of communication at that end has led to breakdowns, wide open shooters, and easy buckets. He sounded pretty frustrated, guys. All right, Ali, thanks once again. And for the Timberwolves, they're shooting a solid 53% from the floor. Conley passes to Reed. Back to Conley. Pass to Reed. Here's Alexander Walker. Five to shoot. They set the pick to stop the drought. The Mavericks pull it in. Lively's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Here's Irving. Garza grabs a board. The Timberwolves have got two of eight shots to drop in the final quarter. Alexander Walker, green covering. Pass to Edwards. There's the three. Good! Another from three. The three is coming fast and furious. He is scorching the nets. Yes, and now tied for the third most three-point field goals in a single game in playoff history. Yeah, ten triples equals Dame Lillard's buzzer-beating performance in 2019 when he waved goodbye to the Thunder. Anderson's checked in for the Timberwolves. Morris comes in for Alexander Walker. The Mavericks have gotten four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. On the wing, Green. Guarded by Edwards. Offensive rebound. Here's Lively. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It's going to be on Nas Reed. Good man. The defender really went after him. Lively. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. Both shots good from the strike. Minnesota has gone three for five from three-point land since the end of the third quarter. 
Pass to Conley. Jacks up a three. And he scores it. Now five of nine from the field. Here in the second half, they're really focused on stretching the floor. And guys, boy, when you're hitting, it sure does work. It obviously opens up major options at the offensive end. They're winning the battle down low by imposing their will. Conley against Irving. Outside Edwards. Up top to Anderson. Over Irving. Anderson can't get it to go. Well, terrific defense. They obviously respect his ability and just want to make it tough. To the paint. Here's Lively. And no good. Nice D from Reed. And so it's Conley who brings up the ball for the T-Wolves. Here's Morris. Yes, great play by Conley to set it up. There's a reason Mike Conley's teammates love playing with him. If you're open, I promise he'll find you. Here's Exum, guarded by Morris. Irving goes in. Here's Lively. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. And I just love how he's making the effort plays that everyone around him appreciates. It is certainly making an impact tonight. No doubt. On the scoreboard, in the body language of the players, you can tell which team is in complete command. Now here's Washington. Outside, green. Three-pointer. Anderson pulls it down. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. Here's Reed. And it goes. As the official calls the foul, count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. Doncic has checked in for the Mavericks. Rudy Gobert has checked in for the Timberwolves. Towns comes in for Morris. They've been playing with much greater physicality this half. Getting themselves to the free throw line is a bust. And the Mavericks call time here. Timberwolves. left side tries a 10-footer another bucket wow and what a night he's had that score now ties him for the single game playoff high for his team he's been nothing short of amazing tonight a legendary playoff performance for him and they double up Edwards pocket six Gobert with a screen on Irving from deep. Conley. Here's Gobert. Mavericks with a rebound. Doncic has got rebound number five here tonight. On the wing, Irving takes the three. Oh, my goodness! He'll go to the line with a chance at a four-point play. That one's on Monte Morris. McDaniels has checked in for Morris. Now at the line for your Mavericks. One shot. That free throw good from Irving. Hey, when you start locking it down at the line, good things tend to happen. Conley against Doncic. Outside Edwards. Conley, a screen on Irving. Down low. Here's Gobert. Oh, and Gobert powers 
brings it home. Well, unselfish play by Anthony Edwards. Teammate is wide open. He puts it right where it needs to be. Doncic finds Irving. And they call an illegal screen here. One of the trickier plays to judge, but it would be hard to argue against the call. It is really difficult to get your feet completely set, to stay completely still. It's almost surprising to me that it isn't called more often. And what a phenomenal replay of that impressive rejection. Oh, you could feel the playoff intensity in that block. He's playing some extra aggressive defense out there. Now here's Conley. Outside Edwards. Launches a three. Here's Gobert. Oh, Gobert rocking the rim. This guy has been a superb offensive rebounder. Gobert uses that size and positioning. Irving with it. He's picked up by Conley. Gafford with the ball. Gafford the screen. Doncic passes to Gafford. And the dunk by Gafford. Oh, nice one-handed jam there, B.A. Hey, little exclamation point. Conley against Doncic. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Mavericks. So it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for the Mavs. 13 points was their biggest lead of the game. Yep, that one's good. Tremendous focus from Kyrie. A little bit of contact not going to alter his shot. Conley passes to Gobert. Back to Conley. It's Edwards on the wing over Irving. And Edwards the bucket on the assist by Conley. Conley's got nine assists in the game. Great passing. Conley against Doncic. Pass to Gafford. Outside Irving. Shot clock at six. Wing shot on the way. And good! There's another. He's on a tear offensively, lighting up the scoreboard with a purpose. And how about this? He now holds the team's single game record for postseason scoring. Edwards for three. Here's Gobert. Oh, and Gobert powers it home. This guy always amongst the league leaders in dunks. Gobert is a force around the cup. Irving against Edwards. Jacks up a three. Minnesota with a rebound. Gobert's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Big rebound there. Oh, connects again. And he now owns third place for most points in a playoff game. Oh, just an incredible game. Nothing can slow him down. And he's not far off from Baylor and Jordan. Can he keep it going? We'll see. The Timberwolves trail. Looking for an opening. Pass to Gobert. From deep, Conley. And the Timberwolves hit again from deep. Poised under pressure. That has come to define Mike Conley. Conley against Doncic. Let's go with a three. And it's Gobert with a rebound. Gobert's got 11 rebounds in the game. Here's Edwards. Yet another bucket. And he's tied second all-time in scoring for a playoff game. Yes, just a miraculous offensive display. This crowd on the edge of their seats. And he's now matched the Hall of Famer, Elgin Baylor. And with Michael Jordan's all-time record only two points away. Here's Edwards. The Mavs get their last shot to go. And they double up Edwards. Right side, Conley. Doncic grabs the miss. Doncic has got six rebounds here tonight. Dallas has gone just one of six from downtown in this final quarter. Let's it go from deep. Rudy Gobert with a rebound. He continues to let it fly, but the makes have been few and far between. Hard work pays off right there. Anthony Edwards finds himself in the paint and draws contact. Drop 
drops the first one. And that shrinks the margin to just four. And this is where leaders come through. Can Edwards cash in at the strike? We'll see. And so he makes both from the line. Well, consistency is so critical, especially in clutch moments. This guy has got that gene. Doncic against Conley. Luka wants, Luka expects to take huge shots. This guy is so big time. Timeout called, the Timberwolves. They're down by five. 52 seconds left in the fourth. against Doncic. The shot no good. And some solid defense from Towns. And this is so critical. They now have to score every trip up the floor. I'll tell you, they better come up with some points on every possession from now on. Edwards can't hit. And now we've got an intentional foul. Second foul. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Yeah, just trying to keep this game alive. Not a bad foul right there. Free throw is good, and that gives him a four-point cushion. Kyrie Irving's history suggests he has ice in his veins. Another opportunity here at the foul line to show how clutch he is. Second one is good, getting both at the line, and it's a five-point game. He's able to make it a two-possession game with some solid work at the line right there. Now a timeout called by Minnesota. They're down by five. There's 21 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Guys, your thoughts? Yeah, they're going to have to work fast coming out of the timeout. This is the very definition of desperation mode right now. They need a quick shot and a quick foul. against Irving. 
Outside Edwards. Outside McDaniels. This one for three. Oh, nails the triple! They're really employing a deep-range initiative here in the fourth, and it's working. It feels like they have worked their perimeter game to perfect, swinging the ball, cashing in from the outside. What a performance. the first one and that makes it a three-point lead did not much phases Kyrie Irving I mean I love him in this clutch spot and so he drops them both and it's a four-point ball game well you love a guy who gets himself to the line takes his time and makes the free throws complete professional So it's the Mavericks who come out on top here. And now that they're up 3-0, winning this whole series is well within their grasp. You think it's only a matter of time, but the postseason is all about expecting the unexpected. They need to stay focused and finish strong. All right, let's send it down to Allie LaForce, who's with our player of the game. Luca, in the end, you guys managed to protect home. We know how exciting this game was to watch. What was it like to play? I mean, it was, you know, intense. I appreciate the crowd was in. Uh, they're amazing fans. They always are here for us in the loss of wins. So I just appreciate them. And they, they just lift us up. It's all for the fans, guys. Allie, thank you as always. That concludes this broadcast of the Western Conference Finals. For Allie LaForce, Grant Hill, and Doris Burke, this is Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching tonight's game. Last but not least, here is your New Balance player of the game, Luka Doncic.